Hello everyone. Today I want to show you how to transfer files between the Windows 10 system with the Linux subsystem. So this year Microsoft has released Windows 10 anniversary version and they have the original Ubuntu Linux system embedded in this Windows 10 anniversary version. So it's kind of a subsystem. So let's get access to this Linux subsystem. And you can see here, this is the original address of Linux system. And this is home directory. And you can go to the root directory here. So if you if we want to edit Windows files, first of all, you maybe you just want to address drag these files to the Linux system. So let's do that. Okay, so you can see this file has already in being in the Linux system and let's do the bash and this is the bash shell and we are in the home directory so you cannot see this new test to linux.txt files in the bash environment so that means direct dragging this file to the Linux system doesn't work. So let's try another method. And actually, this is the method that actually works. So let's go back to the root file, root directory, sorry. And let's go to the MNT directory. And you can see there are three drives here. And let's go to the C drive. Actually, this this is the C drive in the Windows 10. So we can see here there's all the files in the Windows 10 C drive. Let's go to the desktop. User, username, desktop. Okay. So now we can access to all the files in the, on the desktop of Windows 10 and using this bash environment. Let's create a file. Test, new test. This is a new test. Okay, so we have this new test file, and we can see this new test file in the bash environment. And actually, you can see there is the actual file in the Linux in the Windows system. So, okay, here it is. So this is new test file. And what if we want to to transfer this Windows files to the Bash system? You can we can use the most commonly used copy command. We want to copy this new test to Linux to the home directory. It's copy to the home directory. Okay, so let's go back to the home directory. And actually, we can see this new test to Linux file in the, in the bash system, in the bash shell. And let's see this file. Okay, so we can actually we can edit this. Windows files in the bash shell. That's quite powerful, right? Because the bash shell is really powerful and there are a lot of commands you can use to edit the file. Okay, so if you want to know how to install this bash environment in Windows 10 anniversary version, I have extra video posted in my personal channel and you can check it out. Thank you.